Welcome to Some Guy's Garage. I've got another piece of audio equipment here in the shop. Uh, I'm gonna open it up for a quick cleaning and figured I'd do another look inside. So this is a QSC CX254 power amplifier. Um, it's a four channel install amp. So these are designed more for um, permanent installations. Um, and it's interesting because it does have four channels. Most of the QSC amps are only two channels, um, but this one actually does have four full channels. Um, something like 175 RMS at 8 ohms and 250 at 4 and I think 4 something at um, 2 ohms and you can bridge the channels together and all that sort of stuff. Um, nothing too exciting. This is a um, power wave amp, so around the same era as the PLX series amps from QSC. It's relatively light at 21 pounds, so not uh, too big of an amp, but it's not a review so much of the amp as a look inside. So let me grab some tools and we'll pop this thing open and see what's going on inside these. I guess just before I open it up here, um, this is why it's an install amp. You don't have XLR inputs and speak on outputs. This has um, Phoenix or Euroblock connectors. So these are little um, three pin kind of terminal blocks that you connect things to. And then the speaker outputs are just um, regular binding posts or barrier strips here. Um, there is all the dip switches on the back here to configure bridged and stereo along with um, clip limiters, high pass filters and things like that normal power input there and this does also have data ports um, this is for connection to QSYS this is the older style before they did network amplifiers but uh, gives you some control over the amps remotely as well but uh, yeah just figured I'd show you that before we open it up oh as is typical some rack rash on the bottom here when you're sliding them in and out of racks it'll scrape against components underneath it um, not much you can do it doesn't really hurt the thing but yeah, let's pop this thing open and see what's going on inside. There we go, get the cover off. So if you've seen my Furman power conditioner video, this has actually got some stuff in it, unlike that thing. Go check that out. It was kind of surprising just how little there was in this big empty chassis. But this has got what you would expect inside of a power amplifier. You've got high voltage that comes in here. All your power supply side of things is over in this section. Power switch on the front there. Um, you can see your inputs here come into these ribbon cables. And then there is some controls up here for the gains at the front and your speaker outputs come off that board here and out the back at this side. And then most of under this is going to be heat sinks and cooling. You can see the cooling fan there. Um, inside looks actually pretty clean. So decent shape for a used amplifier. If I didn't mention, I bought this used, but yeah, overall here, pretty clean design as you would expect from QSC. They're one of the leaders in power amps and it does go to show like, um, good design and everything seems neat and tidy and as you would expect. So I've just pulled off the fan here, so the fan and the shrouds and the little duct here and you can see inside here the big heat sinks on all the four channels. Um, you can see why I've opened it up here, especially if I put it maybe at an angle there, but there's a fair bit of dust and other grime um, just on these heat sinks. So getting this cleaned out just helped the amp perform a little better. But anyway, that's a look inside a QSC power amplifier. I'm gonna get this thing cleaned up. But if you have any questions about it, let me know in the comments below. If you're not already subscribed, please consider it. And as always, thanks for watching.